Resoliva Dashboard and Reservations Panel Overview. This is the screen that welcomes us when we open the admin panel. It is called Dashboard and includes shortcuts to stuff we frequently need. This is the Reservations window. The Alerts window here reminds us of things that need our urgent attention. And the window here at the bottom is a shortcut to menu items found in the Quick menu. The Reservation Summary window is a shortcut to actual reservations. We will begin by working on it. For example, this cell implies the reservations received today. Clicking on it updates the reservations table to show today's reservations. This cell shows the checkouts plan for tomorrow. Clicking on it updates the reservations table to show tomorrow's checkouts. We can make more specific searches by using these filters here. Reset the existing filter first. Use the filter here to find reservations made during a certain date range. Choose dates. And search. Found five reservations. Reset filter again. These boxes are used for specific name searches. Write a name here. Click search and we found all Johns. Reset filter again. These filters here on the right sort reservations according to their source and state. Here is shown the possible states for reservations. Search rejected reservations, for example, and found none. Let's try approved. Found one approved reservation. Reset again to sort according to source. And here are the possible reservation sources for this hotel. Choosing this item, we found all reservations coming from the property panel. Here we can turn filter on and off. We can also mark reservations like we mark emails. Mark is unread for example. Or flag for follow up. That is it for the reservation filter. Now, let's check reservation details. If we click on one of them, we come to the reservation details. Here on the top is the general information about the booking. Here, guest info. Contact details. Prices and payments. And flight details, if any. Let's go through other details of this view now. For example, we can take a printout of the booking here. Reservation state is shown here, and we can read the help here for details. Add notes about the booking here. Send message to customer. And those realized no-show buttons at the bottom become active only after the reservation is due. Marking bookings realized is necessary to activate feedback messages. That's it for the reservation details. Now, let's try using the property panel booking feature. Clicking here, we will go to make a property panel reservation. That is a reservation we make in the name of our guests. This kind of reservation has a number of exclusive features which we will now see. For example, this button here allows us to directly apply discounts. Enter a discount and click continue. Fill in guest details. Here on the right, we can see the discount we recently applied. And on this page, we find another feature of property panel reservations, which is skip payment. Finally, complete and confirm. 
At the end of property panel reservations, like all other reservations, the guest receives an email containing the reservation details as well as a password for hotel membership, thereby becoming a member. Let's check the reservation window now. Here it is. The new booking has shown up at the top, marked as property panel reservation. Property panel reservations are free of charge.